Hey guys, welcome back at the Wageningen, the online open day of Wageningen University. And I'm Nani, I'm a wee vlogger, so I go around the university and show you my life as a student. And today I'm in a practical, so it's not a normal lecture. So I'm walking around here with a bunch of students, I even have to wear a lab coat. So I'm going to walk around and ask them, what is the point actually of being here? What are we doing in this fancy building with the fancy equipment? So I see a student here with a lab coat again. Hi, um, I'm going to interrupt you, is that okay? Yeah, sure. Okay, can you tell me actually what, what are we doing here in this practical? Yes, yeah, so this is the course Nutritional Physiology and the students, they are um, performing a practical at the moment. What kind of practical? What, do, what are they doing specifically? We are looking at the triglyceride content of liver. That sounds really fancy. So they're working with human liver or what kind of liver? No, this is from a mouse. So they're looking at the liver of the mouse to check for diseases or something? Yes, so they have uh, two different uh, kinds of diet, these mice, and they have to investigate which liver belongs to which diet group. Okay, so then they will see if the liver is from a healthy mouse or not. Yes. Okay, that sounds really interesting. Um, I'm not a, a beta student, I study communication science, so can you explain to me how often are these students here and which studies are they uh, from? Uh, so mainly they are nutrition students, either from the bachelor or from the master, but also biology students. And for this course they are in the lab once a week on the Thursday. Okay, so they come here every Thursday to look around and work with mice and their liver. Yes. Okay, thank you very much. Um, I'm gonna keep looking around for more students to keep the asking questions and sniffing okay. around like the mouse. Yes. Okay. Thanks. Okay, who else can we get to ask questions? I see this guy? Sorry. Hi, Hi. can you come with me? Can you, Hi. because I have some questions about this practical. Uh, first of all, what's your name? Uh, my name is Quinton. Okay, uh, Quinton, what do you study here at Wageningen? Um, I'm a second year master student of the program Nutrition and Health. Okay, so you're a nutrition and health guy. Um, do you come in the lab often? Um, yeah, quite often, especially during my thesis. I was working well, for some months almost full time in the lab. So then you spend quite a lot of time. Okay, and what is your favorite part of working in the lab here? <laughs> um, well, my favorite part here is that, um, well, my thesis, I had had some ideas initially before I started measurements and that they, some of the ideas were actually confirmed. So then, it, yeah, it gives a really nice feeling. If you Okay, I've, I, I haven't worked in the lab that often, but what is the most difficult part of it? I imagine there must be some difficulties or stuff like that. Yeah, of course. Um, it can also be pretty frustrating if you're spending like weeks on a certain experiment and it still fails and you, you don't know why. It can be very frustrating, but in the end, normally you can solve it. And you're here, I think you're also in the practical, or are you helping the students out, or what is your task here? Um, yeah, I'm trying to help the students out for their questions, and especially since many students don't have that much experience in the lab yet. So it's you work around and help them and tell them what to do? Mm, not completely, because <laughs> they're kind of supposed to uh, yeah, figure it out, yeah, but of course when they have questions and really don't know what to do, I'll help them. Well, thank you for answering my questions as well. Um, so guys, did you, as you can see, it's pretty fun work. I can imagine, because I don't do it that often, but by the look of it, the students are now um, working with all of the liver pieces, we assume. Um, this was all that I have for you today here at the, at the practical. Um, tune in at 11 o'clock because we then have a student advisor that is going to tell you more about the study rural innovation and development, I, uh, I assume. But don't forget to check that out. And if you have questions already, just ask them to our chat man and he will try to push them through so they can be answered. So thanks for watching this part and keep enjoying the online open day.